Johanna Vanderspool and you are watching Expedition Joe. I'm here at the Royal Palm Place in Rome? No. London? No. New York? Los Angeles? No. Here in Boca Raton, Florida. Wow. By a local artist named Yapo Keller, and behind me is the Boca Raton Museum of Art. So, I think when you come to a small town like this in South Florida, you take in the sun, the beauty, the fun, but also try to get in with all the local artistry. Right behind me is the Boca Raton Museum of Art. Now, it's about to rain. So what do you do on a wet, rainy day in Florida? Go see some art, of course. What I love about art so much are quotes like this from Picasso. Art washes away from the soul the dust of everyday life. Amazing! And I'm hoping that they have Picasso in here. Right now what I can see just from outside are some teacups stacked up high. So I'm not sure if the Mad Hatter is in there waiting for me or I'm just supposed to have a cup of tea after I see some art. Either way, I'm going to try my luck in here, see some cool things, and hopefully when I come out I can actually meet or bump into a local artist. Why not, right? Come and join me. So everybody, I'm here with Jakob Heller, right? Jakob? Oh, nice to meet you. Very nice meeting you, my goodness. And he is the artist of the Temptation sculptures of Adam and Eve and the serpent outside here at the Royal Palm Place. Oh my goodness, Jakob, it's beautiful. So what, what generated like your inspiration to do the original two lovers, Adam and Eve? Well, actually, it was a commission by a, a man who had a Garden of Eden, a six acre estate in South Miami. He had wild animals, he had uh, ostriches, but uh, he commissioned me to do this. I did a pair of candlesticks with Adam and Eve for him first. And then he started collecting my work, the late Sid Simone. When he died a few years ago, his wife called me and said she's giving up the big house. Do I have a place to put the Adam and Eve sculptures? I said, matter of fact, I've got a sculpture garden right next to my gallery. I'd love to have them. She says, well, just come and take them. So this was a huge commission. It was very expensive to make it, and I wound up getting it uh, bequeathed to me, actually. That's impressive. I mean, that's very rare that you get to have your art back especially when it's been commissioned. But, well, I, I've had a blast talking to you. Thank you so much. And I think uh, your, your, your representation of the first two original lovers through Adam and Eve, it, they're beautifully done. Thank you. Thank you, Jim. Thank you. Huh, look here. Look what we got. Looks like Bob, I came across the original two lovers, Eve and Adam. According to Bible legend, Adam and Eve are the parents of modern civilization, right? So clearly, we live a long time, enough to copulate many times over and populate all of us here. <laughs> but uh, he's a stud. Wow, look at that. Of course I've become a lover to this man. My goodness, look at him. Stellar. Hello. Well, Eve, thank you so much for being the original two lovers and showing how a woman gets it done, right? Getting out of the forest and making civilization.